So you want an organizational chart that is interactive and updates in real time. We can add Andrew here and put in parentheses CEO and you'll see it automatically updates. We can update also the people and it will automatically update. So let's see how to build this. So first you need two things. You need the role or what you want to display. And then you also need a reports to literally who is this person reporting to. Select the columns, go up to insert chart. And over here on the right, when we select our chart type, we're going to scroll down and we're going to select this one that has names here and it's called the organizational chart and that's it. Now we can of course move this to its own sheet. If we want to export it in some way, we can publish it or copy it somewhere. But for now, let's look at how we can make this a little bit better because this reports to, as you saw, if I change to Brad, well, the whole thing breaks and I have to go over here and replace. But we can actually right click and create a drop down menu, drop down from our range, let's say, and we can say A2 colon A. And so now the range that we're gonna get our options from is from here, done. And we can change this to all of column B. And now it's much easier to update and be interactive as we change this CFO, let's say, to a name, Carl with a K, CFO. And now we see immediately, oh, we need to change this one. There we go. So that's much easier to change once we have all of our options here and we can just click instead of having to copy paste them.